guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Megan with The Tiny Moose, and you might know us from Instagram for our Play-Doh and our homeschool curriculum. And today I'm gonna to share with you our second grade pick, so let's get started. Today we're gonna to talk about our second grade homeschool picks for math. Our math curriculum this year, I am actually super excited about because Nora picked it herself. Um, our spine for our math curriculum this year is going to be Prodigy Math. And you can actually go to prodigygame.com. And this is a really cool app. Let me see here if I can just show you a little bit about the app. Right now we have her in the first grade, but you can go over to curriculum coverage. So right now she's in first grade. And this is everything that it's covered and the skills that she's mastered. So four out of six fractions, not there yet. Um, and she just found this. She saw a commercial for it and found it. And she was like, Mom, I think I want to try that. So um, it tells you their progress. So it tells you the curriculum that they've covered so far. And I just think this is really neat. So there are, they can, you can set different goals. You can actually like get a report card. So this would be really great come evaluation time. You could print out the report card and just have this ready. So then, so right now, as of May 2021, she's in first grade, and then you can change this to second grade and so on. It looks like Prodigy goes all the way to eighth grade. So this I'm really excited about because she found it and she's excited about it. And it's not a fight to do to do math. It just gives you last week, things that she completed, what she might need help in. So, and then it says here, like, may need skills. Okay, got it. And there's free worksheets too. But, um, so this says like may need help with these skills. So that's really cool. So our, our spine is gonna be the Prodigy Math and then some other things that we're gonna supplement with just so that I know that I can help her in areas because she's gonna need help. You can't just like set them free on an app and expect the app to teach them. So I'm also going to make sure that I'm tracking her progress. So like I said, we do different themes each month. And so as part of those themes, I'm going to incorporate, we have several different kinds of these books. And this is for ages six plus. It has multiplication, addition, division, subtraction. And there are different themes, like this is dinosaur and the moon. And I know that we have a zoology one. So this is math that you would need if you had this specific job. I have these linked in my Amazon storefront. Um, you'll have to buy them used, but they're a really great resource. I'll show you a little bit about the inside. All right, so that's that. I'm also gonna use the elementary math dictionary from Osborne. This is our family math. I'll also link this in our Amazon storefront. We're gonna put this in our morning basket because this is just like quick math that the whole family can do. Everybody can get involved at a different level, which is really fun. So that, that's just gonna be some kind of warm up math for us. We're gonna work more on with flashcards so that we can get our math facts down. Always manipulatives, always, always, always. Sensory play and manipulatives, the best way to learn. When the hands are busy, the mind is open. And then the last thing that we're gonna do as part of our math and our ELA, our language arts, is our morning school. And this is a program that I created to, I'm not gonna show you the inside yet. <laughs> I'll show you that on another video. But this is our morning school. And this is Nora's binder and she can decorate it however she wants, just like when we were in school and we get to write all over our binder and do all kinds of fun stuff. So I want her to have ownership of this binder. This is gonna be our morning school, just to get us warmed up, hit the core subjects, hit math, hit language arts, make sure that she's kind of staying on track with the standards. This is gonna be each morning, it's just gonna be like a quick, there's the schedule inside that shows her what her day is gonna be like, what to expect. Um, the calendar, keeping track of the days of the week, learning the days of the week, and numbers, numbering the calendar. She's gonna have math facts in here and also language art skills. So this is our Tiny Moose Morning School. So this will be available July 1st, um, just as part of the new curriculum that we have coming out. We have the Tot School coming out and we also have the Morning School coming out. And this is what my kids are gonna be doing each and every morning while I'm drinking coffee. It's just our time together in the morning to sing and snuggle and make sure that we're getting our brains warmed up and we have that quality time together in the morning. So Nora's gonna do her morning school and Kanan's gonna do his tot school. And this is how we're gonna start each and every day. So I will have more on this in another video. So stay tuned for that. 
And then the last, uh, lastly, what we're gonna do for our homeschool for math is games. Nora said this past year, the best way she learned math was through games and through just like real life, paying for things, using money. Um, she's actually been teaching her brother coins. So I think that's been exciting for her. I think the older ones get excited when they get to help the younger ones. So some of the games that we're gonna play are Clumsy Thief, Perfect Timing, we always have dominoes. We like the colored ones because those are fun. We play lots of dice games. We've got lots of different kinds of dice. Dino math tracks for my dinosaur girl. Sums in space. This is one of our favorite ones. We all like playing this. And this is gonna be a new one for us. This is money bags. I haven't opened it yet. But I have a whole list. This is just a couple of our, this is just a couple of the games we're gonna play. I have a full list of games on our Amazon storefront. So I will link that below as well. So this is what we have for our new school year for math, and I hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you have any questions, drop a comment below. DM me on Instagram. I love to connect. Stay tuned for more of our second grade curriculum picks. Please like and subscribe and save this if you're on Instagram.